Here in Montreal, we are very lucky because there is uh, there are a lot of artists, of multimedia artists, movie directors, but almost nobody are used to work in domes. We try in the past to explain to those guys how to work in 3D in a sphere, how to use fisheye lenses, the dome master format, and it's a very, very long process, and some of them never get used to it. But as soon as you put the person under a dome uh, with a video projector and a computer, they, they see it uh, instantly, and it, it becomes easier for them to be creative, and that's why we are working with them. What we liked about the Full Dome Pro Studio Dome is that it gives a very sharp image at the end. So you have a video input so you can plug your computer, but it uh, can be 2K, 3K, 4K images. So that way you have the, sh the sharpness and you can emulate your big dome. And this is very valuable because the time in the, in the big dome is priceless. So having many projectors sometimes comes with problem of alignment and things like that. And because there are a lot of artists working in the dome, things move a little bit. And in the full dome pro system, what we like is the calibration system. It's very fast, it's very easy. It was very easy to operate by our technicians. And at the end, the artists themselves were uh, calibrating the dome. So working with the Full Dome Pro system this summer turns out to be very useful for our latest productions, the Pluto movie and the Aurorai movie. And now we are thinking about installing maybe two domes in our planetarium for production. One mid-size that will be used for editing and for emulate the, the real dome. And probably a second one, a smaller one for editing and for the director. I believe this will help us a lot in our next productions in the future.